is plot our quadrants. So right now we see my angle u has to be greater than pi half, but less than pi. So let's go and take a look at where my triangle has to stand for that. Oh no, this is pi halves, pi, three pi halves. So if my triangle has to be greater than pi halves, but less than pi, we know it's going to be in the second quadrant. By completing a triangle in the second quadrant with the central angle, it's going to look something like that. right? So now it says my cosine of u, so my cosine of my angle, is equal to negative 2 over 3. Remember, cosine, when dealing with the triangle, is adjacent over hypotenuse. Yes? So this one's asking for tangent? Yes, we're going to do the tangent for this one. On your, pro on your homework, I asked you to do sine of 2u, cosine of 2u, and tangent of 2u. I'm just doing tangent of 2u because last video I did cosine. So I'm just doing one at a time. Okay. So here's tangent of, so now what I'm asking you to do is solve for the tangent of 2u. Well, so solve for the tangent of 2u, well, first of all, we know that cosine of u is negative 2, or is negative 2 thirds where it's this will be your adjacent and this is your hypotenuse. So to be able to find the opposite, we obviously have to use Pythagorean theorem, right? So that's why I chose to do one that's a little bit different than the last one. The last one was easy. It was a Pythagorean triple. This one's a little more difficult. Let's call this uh, y plus negative 2 squared. So we get 9 equals y squared plus 4. Now. You could say, well, it's plus or minus, right? You take the square root, you know, plus or minus, plus or minus the square root of 5. But since we have the constraint of it has to be in quadrant 2, we know that this is a positive square root of 5. All right, so the formula for tangent of 2u. That means 2 tangent of u divided by 1 minus tangent squared of u. So all I'm simply going to do now is I know tangent of u is, remember, opposite over adjacent. Whoa. So what I'm going to do is now just plug that in. So I have 2. The tangent of my angle u is going to be opposite over adjacent. So it's square root of 5 over negative 2 divided by 1 minus uh, square root of 5 divided by negative 2 squared tangent of u squared. Does everybody follow what I've done so far? Okay. So let's multiply this across. When I multiply this across, I know that those are going to divide up to 1. And I'm just left with a negative square root of 5 over, uh, when I square this, I'm going to have 1 minus the square root of 5 times square root of 5 squared is going to be 5. And then negative 2 squared times negative 2 is going, is going to be a positive 4. So I get a, a 1 minus 5 fourths. Right? Does everybody follow me so far what I've done? I just multiplied that up top, and then I squared that on the bottom. Now, you've got to subtract fractions. So I've got to multiply by 4 over 4. So let's uh, rewrite this. So I have 4 over 4 minus. 5 over 4, which equals a negative 1 fourth. So now I have negative square root of 5 over a negative 1 fourth. Well, to get that off the bottom, I can multiply. First of all, we see that the negatives cancel out. But I'll multiply by a 4 on the top and the bottom. My negatives are now going to divide to a positive. That multiplies to 1. And I'm finally left with the final answer of 4 square root of 5. So it's some algebra you guys are going to get some practice on.